Samsung released a new streaming music service today that surprisingly is maybe worth a look if you have a Galaxy device. This is Milk. Let's take a quick look at it. So all lactation jokes aside, this is Samsung's music service and it really is called Milk. Now they've partnered with Slack Radio to give you a radio-like or Pandora-like experience, if you will, that has over 200 genre stations and that also has over 13 million songs. So I've taken the time to look through at least the hip hop section a little bit and uh, found all the artists I wanted, things like that. So the catalog actually seems to be pretty legit. Uh, now, there's no setup required. There's no registration required. This is essentially one of those apps where you install it, open it, tap play, and you can start listening to music from all sorts of different genres, which is kind of cool. It's, it's kind of a no-brainer, a no-fuss music service. Now, there is one catch, though. You have to have a Galaxy device. So it's exclusive to Galaxy devices. Now, I'm running it on a Galaxy Note 3. If you have an S4, S3, or Note 2 or something like that, you should be able to run it as well. Now, apparently, you can sideload this on other devices if they're rooted and maybe tweak some settings and things like that. That. so it should run on other devices but technically it's a galaxy exclusive uh, but otherwise i'm actually kind of a fan of it i'm not going to lie if i was using a galaxy device on a daily i would uh definitely give this some run from time to time so essentially this is how it works you open it up and the first time it'll actually walk you through a tutorial but i'll sort of show you now so you can tap in the middle and you get this sort of two-part dialer if you will so on the outside you can see there's hip-hop rock country and there's all these different genres out here now you can just sort of grab and drag and you could get to different genres you can also just tap and get into one now that's sort of the fast moving dialer the other part of the dialer is on the inside so if you're in a genre and you want to go a little bit slower maybe go station by station the inner dialer will sort of let you do that so it doesn't just whip through it you can see how fast you can go through the outside if you want to go a little bit slower you just sort of jump on this inner dialer here so the sort of navigation of it's cool and simple at the same time now down at the bottom you have your sort of standard play pause or next track now you notice if i switch tracks a couple times there's a sort of a countdown here it only let you switch tracks six times within an hour so yes there are some ads and they're going to play some ads in between tracks and things like that. It's like having a free account with Pandora. Uh, I'm sure you'll get over it. You can see right there is a milk ad right there. You can skip that apparently. So simple, simple uh, controls. There is a menu button down here where you can favorite songs, tell it to never play a song again, add it to your stations or even create a station from that song, which is pretty cool. Um, if we swipe over from the right, this is where you get into your simple menu. So up top here, I could create a station like say Rick Ross, and then uh, it just starts playing a Rick Ross station. Now, if I swipe back over here and go into manage stations, you'll see there's a Rick Ross station. If I go up here and hit the little menu and edit, you can actually add other artists to that station. So then it's sort of, uh, let's add random things like Diddy. So then it will sort of um, limit, I would imagine, what artist you're gonna see. Um, so it's not just playing this wide range of Rick Ross type music. It'll actually pull from maybe some of these other, other artists and really narrow it down so you can have sort of a really customized radio experience. Kind of a cool idea. And you can see you've got other ones in here. So if you wanna remove them, you can do that as well right from in there. So if we go back here, um, you can customize the dial. So if you don't wanna have all those different stations on there, like I don't want classical or country or dance, um, we'll leave rock pop some of those other ones let's get rid of alt indie and if we go back here swipe over you can now see that the categories or genres there aren't so many so it's not quite so overwhelming so i can just tap into one start listening to pop or i could go to hip-hop or i could go to rock and then on the inside again i can tweak uh, station by station sort of in there um, if you go up into my stations, this is where any station you've created will appear up here. I've only got a couple, so you can see that's why it's jumping through that so quickly. You can also tap this little pull down menu up here and jump through all sorts of different genres. In case you don't want to deal with the wheel, you can sort of do it right through here. And you can see there's all sorts of stuff from old school R&B, um, there's 70s rock, folk, all sorts of stuff in there. So lots of stuff to uh, choose from in here little aoki there for you uh, if we swipe that menu back out you can go into favorites so you can actually favorite songs and then you can sort of play those or play stations based off of those songs uh, history this will show you everything that you've played and if we go into settings here's some stuff you might want to tweak so you can see it did attach to my samsung account uh, but audio quality i changed mine from standard to high it was set on standard by default so you may want to tweak that to high um, allow application to use my location i 
said on, though I'm not really sure why. It's probably just gonna tell me ads based on my location. Then explicit content, because we like it dirty sometimes, we turned that to on as well. So, you know, that's essentially what you're looking at. This is Samsung's Milk Music Service. Again, it's free as long as you have a Galaxy device. Um, and I tried to swipe from the bottom there. So here we go. Swipe from the bottom here, you get one other last menu I wanted to show you where you can fine tune a station. We can actually have it play more popular songs or less popular songs, um, newer or older. And then uh, based on your favorites and stuff like that, I believe as well. So you can actually really fine tune some of the stations. Again, it's, it's a really nice app, surprisingly. A lot of Samsung apps I'm not a fan of, but the UI here is really well done and uh, this sort of dialer thing, and just the, the idea that you can instantly play music for free, just because you have a Galaxy devices in any sort of genre based on any sort of artist, favorite artist, things like that, really kind of a cool idea. So we just wanna give you guys a quick tour of it. If you've got a Galaxy device, might as well go download it. It's called Milk, it's free. It's on Google Play right now. Uh, if you've got questions, comments, anything, let us know. We're Droid Life, peace.